we are here in the US Open in Huntington Beach, uh, one of the huge, huge events in the year. It's a dream to every single surfer, you know, be, be part of this event. This year, the US Open, I still had a good run. We had a really good heat and stoked, stoked to be here still and watch really good surfing. There's more and more people coming. It's just, it's a process and of course, it might not be as easy economy-wise for everybody from Latin America to come here, but it is possible, you know. Costa Rica is really big, you know, it's getting bigger in surfing. Uh, a lot of good surfers right now, uh, juniors coming up, and the people from, from North America is looking more down to Latin America and try to, to make progress, you know, down there. I think like South American surfers are really, really good at the moment and like, you know, like we're starting to really get um, more confidence in our surfing and what we can do. When I was a kid, you know, I, I was really hard for me coming out. I don't have a sponsor, I don't have boards, I don't have anything, but I have this, all these people that help me out my life. Uh, what I want to do is like open a gate, you know, for the people from Costa Rica, Latin America, so they can come up easier, you know. They come from a different country just because I know how hard it is to come here and try to like do well at contests and all these things you have to deal with. I'm trying to be here for anybody that wants or you know needs advice or something and or to go come here to do the sport. The future of the surfing is in the kids, so we have to help them to them to come out and try like open gates. You know, I know it's a lot of people, you know, in, in the whole Latin America. I really felt that support from my people, so I want to show those kids that I'm there to support them too. If you believe in them, they believe in themselves kind of thing.